guys welcome back to another video in this video we will learn how you will use medlab for plotting so for example i am taking my function y is equal to sin x to plot in medlab and the value of arguments are input x that range from 0 to 2 pi radian as i am told earlier that for the trigonometric function the input is in radian so let's code this for input i will take my input in step size so for the initial value x can start from 0 then put semicolon and put the step size so the step size should be as small as the graph should be uh, smooth right and the end value 2 asterisk pi put semicolon and for the plot y is equal to sine into x it was done now let's draw this for draw write down plot and on the x axis i want to uh, put x and on the y axis i want to put sin x so i will write this y put semicolon don't put semicolon i'll this you will not get your result run this one that's it you get your result on the x axis this value or the x axis and on the y axis we will get sin x value so you can also write for grading g r i d and run this a grids will appear in your graph okay if you want to label your graph you can label this by writing down x label and what should print on the x axis i just want to print x right and on the y label what you want to print i just want to print y or i want to print sign x right okay now run this program sorry just in this and you will get the result on the y axis i print sign x and on the x axis i just print x you can also label your program or your graph by writing down title and put uh, any any title you want to put for example i want to put simulated academy so let's see what should it print here it is the, the it is printed the title of this graph okay if you want to print cos x as well on this graph so just write down another variable and write down cos x right and and what you will change in the plot variable just write down comma x that should be print on the axis and put g right and just run this Th there it is one is, this is the red one is for the x axis uh, for the cos and the blue one is for the sin x right if you want to make field changes you can write down another command that is for example put comma and write down k dash and for this i will explain what does it means r double dash and put in single quote mark okay just run this okay as it say it is indicated when i put k negative it means that it will draw a smooth line and its uh, its color should be black and for the cos data it should draw the dotted line and its color should red make sure that do not write down b here if you write down b here you will get the blue color as it can see in that it is shown as a blue color right okay so this was the function that how you will write down the function two function in the same line so if you want to shoot the graph to you that which one is the cos one and which one is the sine one you can write down legend command and put the first one is sin x and comma sorry comma and the second one is cos x right and just run this okay and it, as it indicated then the dotted line is sin x the smooth curve is the sin x and the dotted line is the cos x 
right okay let's change another variable how you will take input from the user so for example x is equal to some variable like this one i i want to cl click uh, clear this so i will write down input and any command i want to ask enter enter z is equal to right and in run this one here it is as it shown that put the value of x so i will put 0 pi divided by for example 50 colon 2 asterisk pi enter it should appear me a graph like this so that was how you will take an input from the user so you learn in this video how you will simulate or how you will plot a graph in MATLAB simulating. These are the some simple uh, commands for the input. If you want to take the input from the user, just type input and the user will enter its value in the range form like this, right? If you want to plot, just write down the plot command. And if you want to label your curve or the uh, graph, just write down the value are the color you want and with the sequence are the type of your graph so i for example want this as in aesthetic it should give me the graph of aesthetic right oh very it will ask me a value because i made it uh, uh, to enter the values from the user right so pi divided by 90 for example semicolon 2 Asteric pi, it appeared me like the dot. The asteric one is appeared here. Then for the x label, you write down x's and in order to for y label, y, y label, and make sure to put an argument, just put single quote. And for the title, write down title and uh, in the single quote, put your uh, you know, your title. And for legend, that will show which one is your cos curve and which one is your sign curve so that was it uh, please subscribe to my channel for further videos thank you so much